Every, nothing. Hurry up! Okay, there's in, Instagram is moving a little bit. Okay, all okay. right. YouTube. Okay. Facebook. Mm-hmm. Okay. We got Instagram. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right. We got uh, a couple of people here on YouTube. Okay. Hey, Facebook. Slow, slow poke Facebook. Let us know if you're in this, this <laughs> wonderful flash sale day live video. Let us know mm -hmm. if you're all up in here, okay? Let us know if uh, we're live. Oh, the, the magician thing is still... Um, we're right. live. There's, there's Facebook. All right. Hey, Kelly, there's but something there's behind no your ear. Oh! That was... Oh. You didn't even try. <laughs> what was that? Oh, God. Oh, my oh. gosh. Oh, oh God. Ugh. I knew there was something in my... Th uh, come on. Pretty good? Am I a good magician? Okay. Maybe I'm not a good magician. I That was that was something. That Please hold was, strong, yeah. Facebook. <laughs> hey, Facebook, hold uh, the line. <laughs> Will T from YouTube is from Canada. That's awesome. What's up, guys? Southside Waldo. Hey, well, yeah. at least you got to see some really bad obold magic. Okay? Uh, uh huh. Yeah. And also, uh, we're starting to get the wolf back in here, baby! <laughs> wolf back, baby! <laughs> wolf back, baby! Wolf back in the house! All over it like hair on a horse. <laughs> Shane, it's incredible. Uh, right, That's where, incredible. Where are you from? I've never wow. heard that. That's oh amazing. Oh, my goodness. Uh, hey, from Michigan, what's going on? Awesome. Fanboy from the Philippines. That's awesome. Hey, mm -hmm. no Starbucks. No, um, Keurig coffee from my desk today. Ugh. Mm. Love it. Every time I, I have Keurig it. coffee, I'm like, ooh, coffee. And I'm like, mm -hmm. I like I. I made my coffee strong, so it, it, I don't know. It just it tastes like coffee. I don't know what the problem is. I like here I coffee. It's fine. I make OG coffee every morning. I grind the beans. You know what I'm saying, so like, I just want a regular coffee maker. I don't care if I'm a billionaire. I'm just gonna still drink just regular grind up the beans coffee, but I'll probably have like somebody else do it for me. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you're, you're going to grind the beans and make my coffee, but it's still going to be a Mr. Coffee. Still gonna be the same <laughs> shit. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh my god. Yeah, the coffee that he makes in the morning is like mud. You put a lot of Dude, it's coffee grounds. So in, strong. It's yeah. It's it's. Jeremy, mud. I'm sorry that you're allergic to <gasps> coffee. I'm sorry I, to hear that. I don't think I would make it. I wouldn't survive. Hey, nope. David from Guatemala. Nope. I'm sure it's not cold there, you lucky dog. I bet it's nice down there. Oh, I wish. I'm telling you that. that. Would be nice. I'm anti Starbucks. Yeah, if there's. Mm -hmm. All right. If there if there's a Starbucks and there's like a local coffee shop, always go into oh, the local, local coffee shop. Local, hundred percent. Always go. Okay. But there's just a lot more Starbucks than there are like local mm -hmm. little coffee shops. Okay? I actually don't like Starbucks coffee, but their espresso drinks are usually my go-to. Um, I love Dunkin'. Like I am a Dunkin' lover, but their <laughs> espresso just isn't the same. So typically, if I if I need that extra oomph and I need the espresso, it's a Starbucks. Um, otherwise, my normal coffee is either just from home or Dunkin'. Uh, absolutely, Vinny. Local business first. Yes. Uh, that's funny, Hunter. Your friends won't drink your strong coffee. <laughs> that's awesome. Um, well, all right, guys. Well, thank you so much for tuning in. This is this is great. Uh, we're usually not live mm -hmm. on Thursday, but if you are here watching us, we really appreciate it. Um, the reason why we're live today, <laughs> we're just keep in mind, we also are going live tomorrow yes. because tomorrow is not only our regularly scheduled Flashlight Friday live video, but tomorrow also is uh, the sale. The sale is going to mm -hmm. be all day tomorrow, but the sale starts tonight. So that's why we're live. We want to talk about the sale and al also give away some free O bulbs oh, yeah. at the end of this video. But the sale starts tonight, so hopefully we can answer some of you guys' questions, maybe clarify some things on these new products talk about the deals, and then tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern time, you can order it. So just keep in mind, if you guys are, I know we got a lot of people from California, West Coast people. For you guys, the sale's starting at 5 p.m. Mm -hmm. So try and get off work early. Maybe you can go ahead and throw those orders in right at 5 p.m. 
For uh, Colorado people, Mountain Time people, it's 6 p.m. For Texas Central Time people, it's 7 p.m. And then for East Coast like us, it's 8 p.m. Xavier, right? Xavier, what time is it in Alaska? And where's my, who's our Hawaii guy? Some, we've got a Hawaii fr fan in here too. So I need you guys to tell me what time those are. <laughs> uh, John, it's, yeah, it's windy here in Texas. I, I gotta be honest, and, and nobody talks about this, but every time that I've been to Texas, I've been in Texas a few times, and every time I've been to Texas, it's windy. It's so windy, dude. And I don't know if it's just because it's so flat or what's going on. But every time I've been to Texas, I'm like, wow, it's really windy out here. And I, I don't know why nobody talks about it. But it's windy in Texas. Okay? Probably not all the time. But when I've been there, it's been windy. I've never I don't been. Know what, I don't know so why. I can't contribute. I don't know why. Anyways. Uh, super windy here in Michigan. Well, I mean, you got the lakes. Yeah. It's probably the wind coming off the it's lakes. It's also, it's not nice here today. It's chilly. It is a little windy. It's rainy. It's just yuck today, so. Well, Midwest, aren't you central time, Will? Right? You're central time? I think so. Right? Oh. Aren't you central time? You're, Come on. You're, you're asking me to think. It's probably like seven. Middle school. If you're not I, central I time, you're, you're east coast time, mm -hmm. then it's eight. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, so we're giving away O bulbs at the end of this video. Let's go ahead and show something to you that we haven't showed you yet. Oh, guys, it's so pretty. And uh, that is the limited edition, mm -hmm. just blue and black Baton 3 here with the awesome wireless charging case. This looks so good. I love how, um, like, you open the case, right? So the whole case is blue, and just like the little hinge right here is black. Um, so other than that, the entire case is blue, but when you flip open the case, you have that little black section there, mm -hmm. and then you can see the top of the light, which is blue. So you're getting that kind of, you know, blue, black, blue. When you have the case open like that, I think that looks really cool. I'm really glad the inside of the case is black. Mm -hmm. Um, it's nice. also the light itself, all of the accents on it are blue, uh, black. So you have the black clip, black bezel on the front and then black little bezel around the switch itself right there. Otherwise, the whole thing is blue. Um, and this looks really, really awesome. Um, I don't have them in the studio here. They're actually on my desk. Um, if I had to compare it, the Seeker 2 Pro in blue is a is very close to this. The, um, the M2R Pro isn't too far off, but um, if you go look at my photo, the Seeker 2 Pro in this match really, really well, just to give you guys you know, a judge of the actual color. It's... It's like um, what's cobalt blue, I think is the term I'm looking mm -hmm. for. It's really, really nice, guys. I think this is probably my favorite blue that we've done. And the case has that nice, like, satin to it. It's got a slight shine like the red does. Really, really cool. Nice color. Yeah, this looks really great, guys. The first thing that I saw just with the blue and the black is, you know, law enforcement. Uh, you know, if you support mm -hmm. law enforcement or you are in law enforcement, you got to pick this one up, man. Because this black and blue just looks so good together. Um, yeah, that, that really, really cool. blue line vibe is really, really cool. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, and it's limited edition, guys. <laughs> that blue looking crispy. It's only a few dollars more than mm -hmm. the red and the black versions. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, that few bucks shouldn't... I, I don't think that should sway you one way or another. It's not, not like, if you much. like the blue, spend a few dollars more. It's like... 71 instead of 67 it's literally like four or five dollars more time yeah so the um premium black or red is 64.97 blue is 71.47 um yeah so like there you seven, go six dollars seven dollars whatever it is yeah yeah exactly and keep in mind this is limited edition so these are going to hold their value really well when they're not available again so just keep that in mind. All the limited edition Olights, they hold their value really well because we only do one run of them. You typically can only get them during one sale, and after that, it's done. So, you know, six months to a year down the road, it might be worth more than what you paid for, probably. Um, so if you guys are um, early access people, you could have placed your order already. Um, I know I ordered my blue one already. Um, but there will be stock left over for the general sale tonight that starts at 8. So although there is stuff left over, I strongly suggest that you guys get in as soon as that sale starts to place your orders for any of the limited editions. The blue, um, the gradient parent 2, the orange marauder. Get those orders in as soon as you can because 
Again, it's a while supplies last sale. Mm -hmm. uh, the case is made out of plastic. Mm -hmm. um, this is just, it, it'd be too cumbersome to have it be made out of metal yeah. and too heavy. Mm -hmm. um, but one thing to keep in mind, <laughs> wireless charging cases, they're all plastic, mm -hmm. okay? Including $250 AirPod Pros. Uh, so, yeah, they're plastic. It, yeah, like all these wireless charging cases are plastic. Um, it doesn't mean that it's low quality. It doesn't mean mm -hmm. anything bad about it. Like, it, it's, it's fine to me that it's made out of plastic. I would never expect something like this mm -hmm. to be made out of metal. I think that's, that just isn't something that happens, The right? other thing but. too is, so there's an 18650 battery in here, plus if you're carrying your Baton 3. If we made this out of aluminum, I think it would just be too heavy for the size and what it's supposed to be. Um, Facebook, can you hear us? Can you hear us, Facebook? I don't know how we could lose sound. That doesn't make any I don't, sense. I don't necessarily think that is us is that maybe eric maybe check your wi-fi or shut your yeah because nobody else um, is saying it yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Um, um not waterproof guys um i did post a picture earlier that he yelled at me for i was out in the rain it, a few raindrops isn't going to kill your case but it has an open charging you. port um it is not waterproof so do everything you can to keep it dry but if you take out your light and it's raining it's not going to be the end of the world uh, I will say this, the black version has a little bit more of a matte finish than the colored versions. So I, you probably can't tell in the video. Well, you, yeah, you can't. But this has more of a... Um, it, this has that look like that hard to even satin explain. like shine to it, but it still has that nice matte feel. It is not a full like gloss. Um, somebody used the right term the other day when we were talking about these, and I don't remember what it was. Um, yeah, so there's absolutely no like sheen to this where the red and the blue have a nice little There you go. That's what I was looking for a sheen, sheen a little I think bit. is the word. Yeah, this is not in, yeah. this is super matte. Like yeah. like totally matte. Um, it feels really good. I, I really like the feel of the black version versus the colored mm -hmm. ones, but I mean yeah. I person like I would pick up like a blue I mean I, I'd say these are probably my favorites, and then and then the red mm -hmm. after that. Um, a lot of people have picked up the red. I think it looks good too. But I would black and blue. I would like pick up the favorite. blue for the collection, and then yeah. pick up the black just for like regular use. Mm -hmm. A lot of people like the red lights though for regular loot uh, use yeah. because you're you're not gonna lose it as no. well as the black one. Like your eye sees red better, which is why a lot of companies use red for mm -hmm. marketing, including McDonald's. I was just gonna say that. Coca-Cola, yep. all that. We've talked yeah. about that before. Your eye just sees red really well. So uh, the red one's really good for an EDC, because even if you drop it on the ground, you leave it on a table mm -hmm. somewhere or whatever, you're gonna notice it a lot better than a black light. Yeah, um, 3.7 times is how much you're gonna get um, out of the case. So with the moonlight mode, which is now 20 days, adding in the 3.7 times of the case that you can charge it, you get 94 days of runtime on that moonlight mode, which is phenomenal. So, you know, take your normal run times, you know, whatever they may be in each lumen setting and then, you know, times that by 3.7 and that's going to be your overall runtime totals. Um, USB-C charging quick charging. Um, it does cut off its power when your light is charged. So you can leave it in the case all of the time. You don't have to worry about it. It's not going to overcharge or kill your batteries. It's, it's like a smart charger, I guess you could say. Mm -hmm. So, um, But yes, that 3.7 times, that means that it can charge your Baton 3 from 0 to 100 3.7 yeah. times. Mm -hmm. Okay? Uh, yes, it's from completely dead. Yes. So zero yeah. to a hundred, three point seven times is what yeah. this case can do. Now, if you have a full charge on your baton three and the case is fully charged, you can get up to ninety four yeah. days of runtime on moonlight mode. So you don't need to worry about running out of battery when you have the baton three in this charging case. The good thing about the baton three is well is it, we're not only increasing run times because of the charging case. The actual flashlight itself has yeah. double the run times of the previous S1R2. And we've talked about that several times. We mention it in our overview video of this sale. 
the run times for each mode is literally double. Yeah. The half a lumen moonlight mode lasts for 20 days on this. Okay, on the S1R2, it only lasts for eight days. So that's like a 70% yeah. increase on the moonlight runtime. Uh, 12 lumens last for 33 hours compared to 20 hours mm -hmm. on the S1R2. Again, 12 day, or sorry, 12 hour, no, 13 hour increase. Mm -hmm. I'm looking at like everything at the same time. Yeah. Um, the 60 lumen mode, which is a great mode to use for regular EDC tasks, it lasts for seven and a half hours on this. On the S1R2, it only lasts for three hours and 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. Um, now, Chance, this is the next Lumen mode is what we're going to kind of cover to um, answer your question. So, on the S1 Arbiton 2, it had, it went from 60 Lumens to 600. Now, that 600 Lumens only lasted for a minute and a half and then dropped down to 300 Lumens for 45 minutes. Now, personally, and I think a lot of people have, you know, seem to agree with me, 300 lumens is a much more useful EDC lumen setting compared to 600. So instead of a minute and a half at 600 and dropping to 300 for 45 minutes, you have 300 lumens for 95 minutes. Yeah. So removing that 600, you're getting double of what the S1R Baton 2 had yeah. previously. Um, and then your 1,200 lumens will last for a minute and a half, just like the 1,000 lumens on the S1R Baton 2, and then both drop to 300. Um, but again, S1R Baton 2, 300 lumens after that 1,000 lumen drop, 37 minutes. Your Baton 3 is 75 minutes. Mm -hmm. So even at those high, either the drop downs are still the same, but you still get so much more runtime out of a really useful setting at 300. Yeah, I mean, 300 is plenty, I think, um, you know, for a sustained higher lumen level on yeah. an EDC light. I would much prefer to have double the run times of 300 lumens mm -hmm. than have 600 lumens for a minute and a half and then have half the run time yeah. of 300 lumens. But a light, you know? a light this size, that's what I would expect. If I need a higher lumen setting for longer... I'm not going to grab an S1R. I'm going to grab a Seeker 2 Pro. I'm going to grab an M2R Pro. I'm going to grab something a little more substantial. So for the size of this light, you know, close quarters, EDC, don't wake up the kids, you know, whatever, I think that is phenomenal. Um, yeah, so that's that's where we are mm -hmm. with uh, the run times there. I mean, much better on the baton three. Yeah, okay. they're really, really good. Um, it still has the uh, battery level indicator mm -hmm. as well in the center of the side switch, just like the S1R2. So it's gonna go to the green, the yellow, and the red, uh, depending on what the battery level is of the actual baton three itself. So you actually have three battery level indicators. So you have Yes. The three-stage indicator in the center of the switch, you have the indicator there on the inside of the charging case, and then you have the indicator right there on the outside of the charging case for the charging case battery mm -hmm. level. If you don't know what your battery level is on this baton <laughs> three, I can't help you. There's three indicators. We can't put <laughs> yeah. more battery indicators on this uh -huh. thing. Like, <laughs> um, come on. <laughs> Quick little side note, someone on YouTube just said that they spent over 159 but didn't get an i5 UV. I don't know where you're from and if maybe you're ha you're, wherever you're from is having a different sale. Um, we will cover quickly the free tiers a little bit after this real quick, um, but over $129 you'll, you guys will get something for free. But we'll cover that in a minute, so YouTube just hang out. Um, but anyways guys, we got the three. Baton 3 is here. You can get it with or without the wireless charging case. Yes. The thing is, the discount's 35% off with the charging case versus they're only 25% off without the charging case. Mm -hmm. And for the blue version, it only comes as the premium edition yes. with the charging case. So you could get these two without the charging case if you want, but you have to get the blue version with the charging case. But again, you're getting a heftier discount with the premium edition that comes with the charging case versus getting it without. So I I see like 95% of Baton 3 sales coming mm -hmm. for the premium edition. Maybe there's a few people out there that don't want the charging case, but it's a big value add for the light and it makes the light much more useful considering that you can charge it 3.7 times on the go. And as you've seen uh, while we've been talking this whole time, I keep flipping it open and closed. 
So just the fidget factor. The fidget factor. It's always the fidget factor. That makes it worth it by itself. Yeah. Also, you're keeping your light safe because it's actually enclosed in something. Yep. Um, so it's uh, get, the, get it with the charging case, guys. Better discount. Tons of functionality there. It's um, one of the coolest things that have come out in the flashlight industry, I think, in a long time. Just get it. Get these with the charging kit. It also charges your S1R baton too. Yeah. Um, so if you have both of these, you can get significant run times out of both of them with that charging case. Um, so definitely, if you are a fan of the S1R baton two and want the baton three, absolutely get the case. Again, it will charge the S1R two. So yeah, most really of you guys really probably have like five or six S1R twos. I have a handful of them. Yes. Yeah, you can, you can charge it with the case as well yeah. if you want to do that. So just get the get the charging case. Guys. Yeah. Uh, up next, mm. the Marauder two here, yeah. fourteen thousand lumens on flood mode. 800 meter beam distance on the throw setting there yeah you can use it as a power bank to charge other devices the uh, usb-c input here allows the light to be charged in two and a half hours now keep in mind this has three 21700 batteries in it that are 5000 milliamps each so to charge that massive of a battery pack in only two and a half hours is amazing that's quick charging guys and it comes with its own power block Mm -hmm. So yeah, I remembered what it was Yeah, you got the wall adapter there. Yeah. Um, and then the way that this opens and closes, so it's waterproof, dustproof, um, is just so cool. It's like an aperture for a, uh, like a camera lens. Mm -hmm. See that? Opens and closes. Um, uh, our CEO is a big fan of photography. Uh, if you guys have seen his like profile on Facebook, it's him like holding a camera. Um, so he's a big fan of photography. So you know this type of open and close for the port is just very very cool um i'm a big fan also of this like heavy duty gear pattern this like su super overbuilt tail cap just looks really cool and it makes it very very easy to open and close mm -hmm. the port there uh this type of like you know turbine it kind of reminds me of like a like a plane engine something like that this really cool milling here uh, this also serves as a heat sink, so it helps mm -hmm. disperse the heat uh, on the head when this thing is on turbo mode. Um, it also has a super aggressive front bezel here. Again, really overbuilt, uh, which gives it more style. You've got the grip around the entire handle of the light. And it's very subtle, but it actually has these little finger grooves on the back here. So it feels even more comfortable when you put your fingers in those little grooves around the light when you're using it. Especially like for me, because I have small hands, so like that rubber grip and those little finger grooves are ideal because it just makes it so much easier to hold. Yeah, I'm just like, uh, when you guys receive yours, like look at it up close. Mm -hmm. Like look at the machining, look at all the detail, look at all the thought that went into this thing. I mean, it really is just, a wonderful thing like any engineer that looks at this looks at this is going to be like wow they did a lot there's a lot going on here um so it's just a very cool just piece to have in the collection uh if you guys can swing it um i would highly suggest picking one of these up not only just for the awesome performance the fact that you get flood and throw and can use it as a power bank it even comes with this really cool case too. Um, something that you guys have been asking, um, we don't have these for individual sale. Um, hopefully we'll see them at some point. But if anybody knows, the orange is actually a little more expensive than the previous limited edition blue because it does come with the case. Um, so I'm hoping that we will see these so those of you who do have a um, Marauder 2 already can get them. But as of right now, only the orange one comes with it. As you there you go. Burn out my retinas, thank you. So I'm flipping. <laughs> so, so I'm flipping between flood and throw, and it's literally just a toggle switch here. So it's just up, yeah. down, up, down, and that's how you flip between the flood and the throw. Now I got like this, All right. these little speckles in my eyeballs. Thank it you. also has the lumen and the mm -hmm. battery indicators on the side of the switch, just like the X9R. Uh, similar to the uh, Seeker 2 Pro as well. So this is the third yeah. light that we've done this kind of design, and I think it's working out well for us. Yeah. I, I really like it. Um, we're basically, you can see there's like little LEDs on each side of the switch and these little this little portion here going around the switch. 
And on the right side, it's gonna show your battery level. And on the left side, it's gonna show your lumen level. And as you go down and up in lumens, it's going to go up and down on the left here, showing which lumen level you're on. And then in real time, it's actually going to change the battery level that you have. Because if you're using the light at a higher setting, then your battery level is going to be lower, right? You're gonna have less runtime. But if you're using it at lower settings, then you're gonna be able to use it for a longer period of time, so you're gonna have more battery life. So the battery life actually adjusts as you change your output. It's the same thing as like, if you're flooring it in your car all the time, <laughs> the gas isn't going to last as long because you're using more gas because you're flooring it all the time. So same here. <laughs> Similar guys have guys. Same um, here. But uh, you can see, you yeah, walked on the moon with it pretty much. Um, but this, this is a very cool light. I mean, the stuff is. we're showing you guys today is very, very cool. I mean, this is some of the coolest stuff in the industry, man. Um, the Marauder 2, you guys can use as the power bank, too. If you go watch our in-depth video of it, um, there is some, there's a little clip that I actually plug my phone into. It will charge it. Um, there's actually an indicator light on the front underneath the, the rotary dial um, that'll flash green so that you can actually see that it's discharging and um, charging like a phone or... Honestly, you could charge another light with it if you absolutely had to. Um, so not too bad. Really, really useful to have that, especially with the three batteries in there. It's going to last for a while. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. and, and we've got raving reviews from our mm -hmm. fans. Like people love the Marauder 2. Um, you know, I've seen just nothing but great stuff about the Marauder 2s. Mm -hmm. uh, and then also, you know, the S1R2 has always been one of our most mm -hmm. popular lights over the past couple of years, which is why we came out with the S1R2 in like over 10 different versions. Yeah. We came out with all these titanium versions. Yeah. We did copper, uh, you know, we did the seasons. We did the uh, the patriotic version. Yeah. We, we, we just kept coming out with the S1R2 because you guys loved it so much. Yeah. So now this is just a new version yeah. of one of our most popular lights. Um, and going back to the Marauder 2 quick, guys, go check out the video from when they first released when we had the black. And Here, hold it. He's yeah. asking to see what it looks the, like in like um, a smaller hand. The black and blue version. Somebody just asked why it's a square beam. Um, we were skeptical of it, honestly, when we first got it. But inside does not do it justice do not look at like the square beam of the throw on this inside because it looks silly mm -hmm. if you look at the video when we took it outside you don't even really see those square edges they blend out beautifully um it's just a really really nice beam in all honesty so get it outside and actually use it for what it's intended for and mm -hmm. you will actually see that Square or not, it makes no difference. It's actually really, really crisp and clear. Yeah, so, so for a tight beam, um, basically when you're shining it out at distance, all that you can see is basically that tight beam at distance, mm -hmm. right? So this is actually smaller than this. Yeah. So at distance for a tight beam that has no spill, you're actually able to see more with this shape versus this shape yeah. because a circle the corners are cut off. You see what I'm saying? So a lot of people were talking about this uh, when we first came out with these in the uh, in the Facebook group. Is people were like, well, actually, as a square for a tight beam with mm -hmm. no spill, you see more because yeah. you get those corners, right? And at distance, it is actually a cool white beam. Yeah. So there is a larger viewing area at you know long distance. When you're, when you're shining it on a tree, you're trying to shine it on an animal, uh, a coyote, you know, a fox, mm -hmm. whatever. Like, you're going to see that animal better at distance with that larger area. Yeah, you guys, you need to get it outside and actually put it, you know, again, for its intended use because it's very, very impressive. Um, that, when we're doing our videos, typically where we're standing and filming, the trees are, what, maybe 50 yards from mm -hmm. us, give or take, and it's... It's like, it's just so easy. Like the light just does so well, especially at that. I mean, I know that's pretty close. It's got what, 800 meters, I think is actually what it comes down to. So really, really good. Yeah, I mean, look, for a floody beam, obviously a square makes no sense. Correct. Because you're getting that spill, <laughs> yeah. right? You got the hot spot and then you have all this light coming off of that hot spot 
as a floodier beam. So of course you want that to be round so you have all of this big surrounding area. Mm -hmm. But a tight beam with no spill, you want that center hot spot to be as large as it possibly can. And a circle this tight, a little sniper rifle looking beam, you're not gonna see that much. This, you're gonna see more. So I think square works a lot better for throw. Whereas flood, obviously you just want this big wide open beam. If that makes sense. Oh, there's okay. So anyways, awesome, awesome light. The Marauder 2 is fantastic. The, the thought and the engineering that's gone through this really, should really easily cool. justify the purchase, guys. Yeah. And the fact that it's limited edition comes with the awesome case, and we have bundles for these where you yeah. can save <laughs> almost $200. It's absurd. I think the number is $199.45 is the savings that you can get. So uh, on something. one of the bundles that we have for this. It's something so like that. So check out the bundle yeah. options for yeah. this. You can save a crazy amount of money. So, for example, your bundles with the Marauder 2, $148.71 is what you're going to save. There's $160 and $199. So that is absurd amount of savings to pair it with a Baton 3, with... Um, the premium version of it as well, a parent two, um, or like the mega pack that we have, which is that crazy savings. So totally, you, totally worth it. If you've had your eye on these and you're like, dang, it's just a little too expensive. Well, get it while yeah. it's on discount, yeah. especially as a limited edition color and it comes with a case. Yes. Like now's the time to actually get it. Mm -hmm. All right. Next up, uh, we'll talk about this one quickly. Um, the uh, the parent two here in the purple gradient color looks very, very cool. We just posted uh, actually a torture test on this exact variant of the parent two oh, yeah. yesterday. And it passed like, cr it's amazing how well this parent two did in the yeah. torture test. Like it blew my mind. Um, YouTube, I'll show you guys momentarily. Um, I, we're at all different angles with cameras and stuff here, but he literally right through the glass. So if you crack that or happen to drill through it for whatever reason, it's not going to be a problem. Um, I threw it at the wall. I yeah. threw it way up in the air and had a smash on the pavement. I beat it with a hammer. Yeah, drilled through the lens. Ran it over with the truck. Ran like. it over <laughs> with her gigantic truck. Um, and it, it actually doesn't yeah. even look that no. bad. That's the funny um, part. The body is definitely dented. The tail cap is rough. Um, and for those of you who kept asking, and I know I responded to as many of you as I could on YouTube or wherever, it does still charge. We didn't film that. Um, we'll keep that in mind for the future torture test, but it charges just fine. Um, if you unscrew these, I mean, it's pretty thick aluminum. So the battery is completely fine on the inside, even though this poor thing went through hell and back. So... Yeah, I mean, I, I know this is like just a right angle light, even, you know, even just classified as a headlamp, yeah. even though it does come with a pocket clip as well. Um, but you can kind of tell how overbuilt this light is just by looking at how deep these lines are here on mm -hmm. the head. So this is a lot of material, guys, because if you look at like these lines here, they go very, very deep. That's giving, giving you really nice heat dissipation with those heat sinks um, because this it does get pretty hot when it's at that 2500 lumen mode, uh, but that should show you just how thick the aluminum is on this light. And I think that's a big part of it being so mm -hmm. robust and doing so well in the torture test. Um, so it, it really is kind of an overbuilt light, you know, when you really look at it and you see the performance in the torture test, um, but you can put it on your head and use it as a headlamp. So it's, it's awesome. Yeah. Um, 21700 battery does make it a little heavy, but with the, um, like the three strap headband, it's super comfortable. You don't really notice it. Um, it's also with a pocket clip, great to put on like the Molly on a backpack because again, um, front facing light. So it's great to light up a trail, um, just hands free, whether you have the headband or not, just use the clip. It's great. Um, yeah. So I would definitely pick one of these up guys. You're getting one of the best performing compact headlamp, right yeah. angle lights on the market. 100%. 2,500 lumens coming out of a light this big. It's, it's ridiculous. In, yeah. 2500 battery is included. You get the headband with it. You get the pocket clip. Yeah. You get the charging cable. It actually is a really nice value. And the fact that it's a limited edition, yeah. we're only going to have these for these sale. So you might as well just pick it up, add it to the collection. Um, right. When these released in black and orange originally, we did do a full in-depth video of that as well. Go see the comparison between the parent and this because I was not expecting it to be 
as good as it was and it just blows the pattern out of the water so go check that video out also and that way you guys can get a little more information on what this light can actually do uh the blue bezels going around mm -hmm. the switch and the lens there look really good too um so yeah pick one of these up guys uh performance is really great um yeah nice. limited edition yeah. you're getting a discount during the sale why not uh, a couple more lights that we'll talk about, and then we'll go ahead and do the giveaway. giveaway. Nice. Uh, something that you definitely have to add to your cart for sure is the i3T in solid brass. This is not a yellow colored light. Mm -hmm. This is not painted aluminum or something that's coated or whatever. Uh, this is solid brass. It is a lot heavier than the aluminum version. Okay, just being honest. But it doesn't have like, oh, this is clunky and I don't want to carry it. It's not that heavy. Mm -mm. It just has that heaviness that you know it's a premium product. Like some stuff, it's good that it's heavier. It makes it feel less cheap. It, like like, like, a, like yeah. a pen, you know, like a, like a nice pen. I like, like a nice solid, like heavy pen. They write really nice. Like you just pick this up and you're like, oh, like this, this does not feel like you know, you picked it up for, for nothing. Like, it feels like a really solid, you know, you say it all the time, a premium light. Mm -hmm. It definitely feels like it's a lot more expensive than mm -hmm. $22, which is actually what this cost during the sale. Yeah. It's like, what, $22, $50, something uh, like that? Something like that. It's like less than $23. Um, $22.46. $22.46 mm -hmm. for a solid yeah. brass Olight, backed by Olight's warranty, Runs off of a AAA battery, yeah. so you don't need to worry about finding special batteries. It's got mm -hmm. the tail switch on it, so it's super easy to use. It's got two different modes. It's not complicated. Mm -hmm. It's a great light, guys. Um, Add they, these to your car. Add a few of them to your car, man. These are fantastic. And I know we say this about the i3Ts in general. Um, they make great gifts. But if you need a gift that's a little more flashy, a little more fancy for somebody... <laughs> Um, this is a really, really good option. Like we were saying it about the copper O-pens, like that's a really nice gift to give, um, you know, somebody to keep on their desk and kind of show off. Like this is a really, really nice, you know, slightly more upscale gift than compared to like a regular black or tan I3T. Yeah, if you give this to somebody, they're going to think you definitely spent more than 22 bucks Ooh, yeah. on it. Okay? Uh -huh. 22 bucks for a gift, like come on. Yeah. Like, uh, that's nothing, and you'll blow somebody's mind if you give this to them. Right? This is something you can keep forever. 180 lumens, um, AAA battery. Mm -hmm. um, so uh, add these to your cart, guys. They're a great deal. Premium material. Uh, and like, like Will just said on Facebook, cheaper than that if you get them in the bundles. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we do have bundle options with all these other lights we're talking about, mm -hmm. including the i3T and brass. Yeah. But... If you do want some other bundles um, that don't include the i3T brass, you could still just get this and add add a couple to your car. Yeah. So it's, it's yeah. Um, if you guys are looking for a specific tier and you need a couple more dollars to get you over into getting a Seeker 2 or something like that, great option is to throw an i3T in. Mm -hmm. um, last one, the O-bulb here. Um, oh, the orange is really cool, guys. We got the matching coin. Mm -hmm. Uh, so you would be able to add a new coin color to your collection. I'm really glad that we actually did yes. a matching coin mm -hmm. uh, instead of, you know, just like the gray or something like that that we yeah. added to the other colors that we did. So you have blue, red, and gray, and now you have the orange. And or, there's green. Or green. I'm mean, sorry. Gray, green, and red, and now orange. <laughs> The blue oval came with a gray coin. Correct. Yeah. Yes. Those are the four uh, colored coins yeah. that we have. Um, but yeah, it's awesome that it matches. Uh, these are great value, guys. They're only 25 bucks, and they come with a charging cable. Mm -hmm. the, the magnetic charge cables, we sell them by themselves for like $12.95. Yeah, so this in itself is just a great deal. You're getting a $13 charging cable plus a metal coin. Mm -hmm. Plus an O bulb, and you're spending what twelve dollars yeah. more than if you just got the charging cable. Yeah, it's a good value. Um, um, people I love these; they're awesome. Okay. I think Facebook is the only one that can actually see this, but like we do have, like we have it stuck to the wall here. Yeah, you guys. Yeah, we got them all over the place. Yeah, they're all over. Like the, the um, three M tape on the back of the coins will literally stick to anything. Like this one, yes, we do. We threw um, a pen in there. You see the pen in the middle of the O? I keep hiding things from <laughs> the, the sign. Yeah. Um, but 
what this is stuck on is like um, is like a textured piece of wood, and it's not a flat, smooth surface, and it is it's not going anywhere. So these coins will literally stick to anything that you need them to. Yeah, it's not some garbage tape. It's three no. M, folks. Yeah. The king of adhesives. All right. So when you stick that Joker on something, it's gonna stay. One hundred percent. Three hundred LSC. I don't know if any of that makes sense to any of you guys. It does not to me, but it is really sticky. Yeah. <laughs> that's all I got. Um, yeah, so that's everything that's on sale, guys. We got the baton three with uh, three different colors. You got the mm -hmm. blue, the black, and the red. If yep. you want the blue, please get it when the sale starts tonight because they are limited edition. I promise you they will sell out quickly. Mm -hmm. We're going to be sending out. We're going to be making that post. Hey, guys, blue sold out quickly. So, guys, as soon quickly. as your time zone rolls around for 8 p.m. Eastern, get those orders in. As soon as you can. Yeah, I'm already ready to send out the post that says blue sold out. <laughs> like, I, I, yeah. I've already got that prepped. Got it. Okay? It's written. Like, it's saved. It's, it's going to happen. All right? Just got a quick post. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Baton 3 is mm -hmm. uh, amazing. Double the run times, 20% more increase in output. And then you have the charging case that yeah. can charge it 3.7 times. It mm -hmm. comes with the USB-C cable, so yes. you don't need to purchase that. comes with a battery for the light, all that good stuff. Uh, we have the Marauder 2s here. Please pick these up at that discounted price while you can. Um, it's an amazing feat of engineering here in the flashlight industry. It's really well done. People love them. Pick these up. They come with the, the case. All right. Um, I3T and brass, come on. You guys love the premium material O-lights. Uh, the Parent 2 is just yeah. a fantastic light anyways. And uh, in the limited edition color here, uh, it's really fun. Something cool to have in the collection. Um, great gift for keep buying your, o bulbs, guys. Your your ladies, because that is right up all of our girls' colors. I see it so many times. The girls who are in our group and everything like that that we want teal and purple and blue and like all the really cool EDC colors to match all of our other stuff. So it's a great gift, hint hint, guys. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so that's where we are, guys. The sale starts tonight at mm -hmm. 8 p.m. Eastern time. So in a little less than seven hours. The official sale starts, and you guys can pick all this stuff up. All right? You don't have to stay up all night. I know you guys got to work on Friday, but you don't have to stay up all night. I mean, it, it's 8 p.m. It could be even earlier, depending on your time zone. So it, it's not a big deal. All right? Uh, let's go ahead and give away some O-Bolts. All right? We're going to give it away first to Instagram, second to YouTube, third to Facebook, because Facebook is the slowest. Sorry, guys. <laughs> So the Facebook fam, just hang out with yep. us for a minute. Let us get through the questions for Instagram mm -hmm. and YouTube. All right. So Instagram, this one is you guys. So let's get some ready. See who's actually paying attention. Yeah. This question right now is only for the people on Instagram. Yes. That's it. So sit tight, guys. Um, Instagram, ready. Let's get some ready. I don't know if we're slow, if you guys aren't listening to me. Focus. <laughs> All right, there we go. Okay, they're they're rolling in. I think they're uh, they're paying attention now. So, cool. Okay. okay. Are you ready? Yep. Go ahead. All right. Instagram ready. Five, four, three, two, one. What is the length of the baton three in inches? Mm -hmm. How many inches long is the baton three? It's just right there on the website, guys. Or maybe you already know it. Either way, not hard to find. One point twenty one gigawatts. <laughs> yeah, yes, that's great. Um, okay, yeah, we got a winner here. Yeah. All right, uh, Pierre, Pierre Ho, Pierre Ho, one two three. How you say that? Pierre. All right, Pierre. Pierre, uh, that's what we're going with. Pierre, congrats. That's you win. Great. The answer is two point four eight inches. I, I've said this a million times. It's literally yeah. the length of my pinky finger. I mean, even me with my small hands. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if we're going from, like, joint to the tip of my finger here. Uh, a little bit, but I have a nail, so that counts. <laughs> the light's the length of a pinky finger. Yeah. That so. should tell you how small this thing awesome. is. Awesome. Um, right. So, Pierre, send us a DM, um, shipping address, and we will get you out your orange o bulb. Awesome. Nice. All right. Thank you so much, Instagram. Very Please nice. set an alarm on your phone. Since the sale starts tonight, you don't need to worry about setting it up on your calendar. All you need to do is just go into your alarm that you use for waking up in the morning and just set an alarm for 8 p.m. Eastern time or if you're in a different time zone, set that up, okay? Mm -hmm. And then that way, when it goes off, you're going to go, oh, yep, 
olightstore.com. Let's do this. And you can get your order in and yes. uh, before everything sells out. All right? Yes. Thank you so much, Instagram. We will see you guys tonight at the website. Thank you. All righty, IG. Bye. All right, YouTube, are you guys paying attention? All right, let's get ready, YouTube, and then we can get you guys out of here so you can do the whatever you got to do for the rest of the day before the sale starts. Yep, and the rest of the work day and whatever. All right. yeah, you guys got to knock out your days yep. quick so you can be ready for the sale tonight. We have plenty of readies on YouTube. They are paying attention. All uh, Facebook again. Just sit tight, guys. Sorry. Okay. All right. Go ahead. YouTube, ready? Five, four, three, two, one. How many inches long is the Marauder 2? Oh. How many inches long is the Marauder 2? Let's see. <laughs> Wolfpack, baby. <laughs> That's so uh, awesome. <laughs> uh, oh, 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 oh. I see it. I see it. I see it. Um, YouTube, Somebody nailed it. Yeah. Toby Hall. Very nice. Toby Hall, you nailed it, man. 5.51 awesome. inches. Again, that's not that long, no. guys. 5.51 inches. I mean, here's my hand. Okay, it's it's not a very long light. Um, and YouTube, I know we only just started live with you guys fairly recently. We go by what we see on our screen. Um, so you may see something different. At, like, as individuals, it can be completely different than somebody sitting in the same room as you. But we go by what we see first. Um, just because we're the ones doing the giveaway, so it's just kind of the way it works. Hope you guys can understand that. So, Toby Hall, you got that one. All right, good job, Toby. Uh, reach out to us, man, and uh, let's get your shipping address and send yep. out your Obel. Right. Um, you can email me at kellyolight at gmail.com if you don't find us on any other social media, depending on what you actually use. So, um, let us know, and we'll get you the Obel. Awesome. All right. Yes. Thank you so much, YouTube. Please check out the other videos that yes. we've made for this sale. We work really hard on the videos and we really appreciate your support on that. We also have some giveaways in there as well. Yeah. Um, so yeah, check out the YouTube channel. There's tons of information about our products on there and uh, we'll see you guys at the website tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern time. Yes. Cool. All right. All right thank Bye, you, guys. YouTube. We'll see you later.